Okay, today we are going to make an account group for vendors. Now, vendors can be different. And how different can be the vendors? Let's see that. Um, account groups for vendors. They can be groups for local suppliers of media. Material can be raw material. Material can be uh, SFG and finished good. Okay. And they can be foreign suppliers for materials, import material. And they can be vendors for services, uh, for um, expenses like internet, like stationery, okay? And uh, we can have separate supplies for raw materials, semi-finished goods, and finished goods. Same for materials for uh, foreign suppliers. And in this case, foreign currency valuation will be done and it has to be configured, which is not difficult. So in our case, make BD46 vendors for Toyo Nasik, right? And it will have a numbering range. In SAP, the concept is quite simple. First, before S4 HANA, vendors were separately made in FI, in MM, and these were not accessible to other modules. Now, in S4 HANA, the difference is you cannot make uh, a vendor in FI MM individually, but it is made in cross application module. Cross application module means you can say cross module. So, if I make a vendor, it can be accessed by FI, MM, SD, HCM with just one numbering code. For example, if the number code is 101 for that vendor, so it will be the same for HCM, for SD, for MM, FI. So, the advantage is synchronization, reporting, and transactional level relationship can be understood as to how is our relationship with the vendor, okay? Relationship means, transaction relationship means how many transactions have been done, how is the payment uh, behavior, how is the supply behavior with this vendor. So, as for HANA, has centralized the vendor master data process, which is called business partner, because your vendor becomes your partner because it is part of your business. Okay. Why? Because they are supplying you services and material. Okay. So the process is quite simple. The process is like this. First, you make an account group in FI. Then you make, then you choose numbering range in FI. Then you make a grouping in cross application module. Then you join account group with grouping. Plus grouping has its own number range. So same number range has to be matched. For example, if the number range in FI is 100 to 199 at cross application module at grouping level, it should be 100 and 199. Only then it will be synchronized. Okay. 
so we will see how vendors are made so we'll go new entries bt46 toyo nasik vendors bt46 Okay, uh, BT Raja Osama. BT 46. Okay, once this is done, then I have to check number range. Okay, the number range that are available to us are the ones which have external checked. Now, what is external? External over here is nothing but it is the authorization given to grouping that, yes, you can make the vendor at cross-application level, not at FI level or MM level. Okay. So, this external check is very important. So, I have to see. 311, B2. 312, this is 0, this is external. Okay, I can use this. Control Y. B2, I will copy it and I'll compare it. Where? In grouping. Let's see. Okay, I have LO. Control Y. I can use my own numbering range, but right now what is available to us will be used. Okay. Okay, but it should have. Can we generate this as well? Yes, we can generate it. You can copy it. You can pass it on to other peers as well. R8 control Y. What is the meaning of SS, yeah, SP, yeah, R8? This is just. Is names of number there's just names there is no it's just a label it's just a title given to number range okay now i will actually go to cross application components over here i have sap business partner Business partner, basic setting, number range and groupings, define number ranges, interval. Okay. Now I have the list B2. Where is B2? B2212212. Two one two one two. No, it's three one and three one two. This is cancelled. Okay, L O. L O five is being used. Okay, same number range. I can use this. So my next number range will be two ten. Okay, so I can use this L O define groupings. The groupings will be the same. New entries BT forty six Toyo Nasik BT forty six Toyo. Nasik BT46 number range LO. Okay. Enter. This is done. Okay. Once this is done, 
I will go back. Create number ranges, assign number ranges to vendor account groups. BT46, LO, LO, not defined for vendors. All right. Can I do by that? Save. Okay, once this is done, I go back to cross application components. Business partner field groupings are done. Uh, sorry, number engine groupings are done. Master data synchronization. This is the next step. Customer vendor integration. This is partner settings. Vendor integration. Define PP role for direction vendor to BP. Field assignment. Direction render to the Master data synchronization. This partner setting vendor category. FN million zero one. Okay. Missing one step. I can't do for it. Your wife is not clear. Legal forms, legal entity not.
properties you know. Center integration. Missing one step, I don't know what to do. This part of six step things. Numbering and groupings. Two attributes for BP1 for a thing to be for the type. Number ranges and groupings define groupings. This is done already, but we have to assign it. Number range is assigned. Okay. Assignment by the attribute not synchronization of mass data. No, just not clicking at the moment. Number ranges, layout groups, new grouping. Cross application. Only data transfer. No, no, no. no. 